Here we have a Curtis McPeak banjo. It's called the Old Betsy. It's modeled after his banjo, which he refers to his favorite banjo called Old Betsy. And uh, let's hear what it sounds like. <laughs> Okay, so uh, we'll look at the uh, pot here, and the pots on all the Gibson copies are pretty much the same with a Presto tailpiece, one-piece armrest, uh, and uh, this has the same inlay pattern that's on uh, Curtis's old Betsy, which happens to be an RB75, uh, original five-string he has. The Spanger sounds extraordinary, and... Uh, it happens to have a McPeak tone ring, a Sullivan, either factory four or old uh, growth uh, shell. Uh, so it's got the best possible components you can have. Uh, resonator, uh, mahogany, and this actually is like Curtis in that Curtis's uh, banjo has a maple neck, which this does, and a uh, mahogany resonator and they made uh, a lot of the 75s were made with those particular woods okay well you probably haven't seen some videos lately and uh, if you want to go ahead and subscribe or if you have any questions you can uh, uh, go to banjowarehouse.com and see some more pictures and more explanations if you want to see the inside you can see pictures of that and if you have questions, you can call Andy at 404-372-5482, and we'll be glad to help you. We've got about 70 banjos here, and we're open seven days a week, but you have to call us. I'm, we're here seven days a week, so if we know when you're coming, we'll be here, and that includes Saturday and Sunday. Just give us a call, and uh, I can guarantee you, you'll have fun. So we'll talk to you later.